What's up guys? There's a new jailbreak for the 4.2.1 firmware and it basically works on all the devices and it's untethered and it's flipping awesome but it only works for Mac OS X right now for the moment but uh, if, uh, if there's a new update or whatever I'll put an annotation on the screen and uh, also I'll put it in the description so you can look out for that. But anyway there, this new jailbreak is amazing and it's untethered for basically all the devices so let's get to it. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to this website. I have it in the description below make sure to look at all the stuff I write down and you can download the green poison right here for mirror one or mirror two and after that kind of going over it mirror two is the best it just kind of works a little bit better so but uh, either way just download the RC5 uh, program uh, not not any of the previous versions okay make sure you get the right one and uh, you use that to jailbreak your device and it's very simple and they have step-by-step -step instructions if you go to the other link. I have another link in the description below and uh, it gives you step-by-step -step instructions and it takes you to this website and uh, it shows you step one, step two, step three and uh, it says download green poison right here but this sometimes it doesn't really work so I suggest using the other link that I have down there make sure just to read all the stuff I put in the description that will help you a lot so alright and then uh, you can either download the iOS firmware right here or you can use the Felix Burns website I have in the description below and that's much better and faster and stuff and if you have problems with the firmware make sure to export it or whatever with WinRoar if you uh, have it in a zip file. So make sure to Google WinRoar program if you don't have a WinRoar program to export a file. Anyway, uh, so if you just follow these instructions, step one, step two, and uh, you basically just plug in your device, shut it off, and you click jailbreak, put it in DFU mode, and uh, you just follow the on-screen instructions, and then you'll have an untethered jailbroken device on 4.2. Point one. And uh, if you want to see if your device is, works with this, you just go ahead and uh, look right here. You go back to uh, the download green poison link I have in the description. And it basically tells you right here, uh, green poison can work on the 4.2.1 untethered for the following devices. iPhone 4, iPhone 3GS, iPod Touch 4G, iPod Touch 3G, and 2G and the Apple TV 2. Now, and you don't even need SH, SH blob saved. So uh, make sure to read through this information so that you know what you're doing and that you can go through this process really simply and easily. Now, once they have a Windows version, I will do a step-by-step -step process for you guys because I am I run on Windows and I don't have a Mac. So this is just basically a big update for you guys with Mac computers and a Windows update because after they come out with a Mac uh, jailbreak, they usually come right out with a Windows jailbreak. So we'll be looking for that, and uh, I'll make sure to put an annotation up for that. Anyway, I'll catch you guys later. Good luck. See ya. Bye.